Hello everyone, Dan here from Sherpy T. Welcome to part three of this Cross Plains at the Farm adventure. Uh, I was lucky enough to get my sister Ann and Don to come down and help me do a little bit of videotaping on this one. My sister is on the opposite side of the pond and uh, Don is operating my drone. So as I'm going through this ice here, it's about two inches thick, and it's, it's, it's above freezing. So unfortunately, I couldn't get up really on top of all the ice. I certainly don't believe that I would actually even walk on it at this particular time because it was so warm outside. So here I'm putzing along. Uh, you can notice the front wheels are a little bit higher than the back wheels. They're switched over the drone. It was a fairly cloudy, overcast day, so the color quality was not good on the drone at all. But like I was saying, you get up, you get the front tires a little bit up on top of the ice. Um, if the ice is thick enough, and they will get up on the top, and they start to drag the back ones up, they'll break up the ice a little bit, and uh, eventually pop right up. Notice here the back wheels, they got a little bit darker water, so I must be just getting down enough there to uh, disturb that silt crap bottom that exists in this pond. And it's kind of hard to tell again because of all that water on top of the ice, but that's fresh ice right there. And like I've talked about, you can't really turn when you're on that ice because the Sherp is longer than it is wide and the back tires are hitting the ice on both sides and it's hard to turn. Little bit steeper than I could get up there. I started to spin and so I popped back down again. And then Ann and Don jumped in and joined me.
So still got my sister Ann and uh, Don in the Sherp and we just putzed around here for a little bit. Put it in fast motion so you could still get to see what we actually did but not bored with all of the activity shall we say. Then we cruised back up to the top of the farm there and then I drove back and went on one final trip by myself. So cruised up over the top, went through the knob. Jumped out here again out in the pond, looked at some of the destruction that took place, really not too bad. I actually know right now, this is about a week ago, everything kind of melted since this thing, whole thing happened, and I believe it is pretty much flat again. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, hit that like button if you enjoy it. Take care.